been working in ASTAR since the year 2000. Over the course of my research career, I've had the chance and opportunity to do research in a wide variety of areas. When I started off, I was doing research in the area of micro electromechanical systems and that is in the domain of engineering design. After that, I've gone into the aerospace industry, medical technologies, to the area of dentistry. I've also had the opportunity to work in the transportation industry through a secondment program. In one of my more recent research endeavours, we've worked with colleagues from National Dental Centre of Singapore in the area of digital dentistry. Now, when we think about dentistry, one of the problems that we are facing is with an aging population. And with aging population, the demand for dental solutions such as partial dentures are increasing. Yet, the availability of manpower, of know-how and expertise is decreasing. Hence, one of the ways to help the society is to bring R&D, in particular I4.0, into the area of dentistry. In so doing, we expect that the amount of time that the doctors need to spend with the patient would be drastically reduced. The turnaround time to deliver a partial denture would also be highly uh, compressed. And at the same time, the cost of a denture fabrication would be much reduced as well. What motivates me in the last 20 years of my research career is really the opportunity to be exposed to many different kind of problem statements. For me, to have a curious mindset is actually very important. And that curiosity actually drives me to look at what actually are the real needs of people around us, of the society and of the industry. After having done research and development for almost 20 years, I've now taken up a new challenge in the area of research management. As compared to my past, where I've worked on the research problem directly and contributing directly, I now work more with the people who are driving the research effort. One of the key challenges in research management is dealing with complexity. In our research environment, to get things right, we have to make sure that there is sufficient talent, we have to make sure that um, there are important problem statements from the right receptacles. We have to make sure that there are resources. We must make sure that the environment that we are in allows our researchers to perform to their maximum. Hence, to bring all this together and to make sure that everybody is being heard is part and parcel of the complexity that we have to deal with on a day-to-day -day basis. Over the years, uh, we have had our leaders who established the, the foundation built up the organisation, created a fantastic culture where there is trust among colleagues and that we are all open to share our views uh, very freely. I think this is a fantastic environment for an R&D organisation like us. If you love science and if you love to solve problems and likes to work with a variety of people across different domains, please join us at IHPC.